Obunga is here. Now I know something about Obunga that you don't know about. We're going to talk about it a little bit later. But yeah, guys, Obunga has been getting super popular lately. And I thought it would be the perfect time to actually make a Roblox account that looks exactly like Obunga. As you can see right here, these two gentlemen are getting chased by Obunga right now. All right, so I have a fresh new Roblox account started here today that we're going to be using for Obunga. So let's go to scaling. I want to make the height all the way up, proportions all the way up. We're also going to put body type to 100% and then we're going to put the width down to around 95%. We got to make sure this thing looks crazy. Now to make Obunga, we're going to have to change a few things here. So we'll put the entire skin tone around here. That should be good for now. And as well, guys, I'm going to tell you something about Obunga that you don't know about, but that's going to be later. Also, in this video, I have a huge announcement. So make sure to keep watching for the announcement. All right, so starting off with our first item, we're going to go to clothing and we're going to go to classic shirts and start off with the first thing that we need. But guys, one like equals one good luck. Obunga will not haunt you in your dreams. And make sure to subscribe as well. That gives extra good luck that Obunga. Um, Obunga won't appear in your dreams. Almost said Obama there, but I meant Obunga. All right, so first item on our list, we're gonna type in Obunga, and let's see if there's a shirt for it. I don't, I don't think there's gonna be a shirt for it because it's pretty much. I mean, you can see from here, it's a suit. It's a suit. So we need pretty much suit pants, suit shirt. So I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna put suit, and then find a suit with a tie, maybe like right here. This could work. I kind of like this, the black suit and then the pants to go matching with it. So they're only five Robux each, which is just absolutely perfect. So now that we've bought that, let's put it on the character, see what it looks like so far. All right, just gonna put them on here in the avatar editor. We're gonna go to profile and let's get a bit of a closer look on how this is looking so far. And yeah, that is looking good. So right now we just have, you know, just a good looking guy, man. Good looking chap, bro. He looks like he's uh, about to run for president. Okay, as, as Obunga would, but uh, Obunga is a little bit different. Now, I have some plans on how we're going to do this. I actually researched some items on different things we can use. And I don't know about you guys, but this is going to be super funny. Now, it's going to be hard to get it perfect, but I do think we can get pretty close to it. So, starting off here, we're going to go to the catalog and go back to the avatar editor because I want to do some things to Obunga first to prepare him for what we need. So, I'm going to go ahead and put on an animation package. Now, obviously, in here... Obunga just kind of chases you very stiffly because he's he's pretty much a JPEG image just after you But in Roblox, he's gonna have animation. So if I could imagine Obunga chasing you He'd probably chase you probably something a little stiff, but something a little terrifying and I think the mage animation <laughs> Will be perfect for that. We recently bought it and I'm wanting to use it more because check this out here it, He's standing like that. He's literally T posing on you pretty much and when it runs after you, it looks just really, really weird. And <laughs> I think you guys are going to like it. Now, okay, for the head, there's a few ways we can go. Now, obviously, though, Bunga head, it's a very stretched image here. And it has basically the eyes right here. Very, very soulless eyes. Very just blankly stare eyes. Very creepy. You know, a long ratio between the mouth and the nose. And yeah, that's that's pretty much old Bunga for you. Some crazy eyes with a very stretched face. Now, there's a few ways... We can do this. One way we can do this is we can find like a really, really stretched face and find like a face. Or we can use like an accessory. But let's see first what a stretched kind of face would look like. There's not a lot of options here. Like there is the narrow face or the man head that might work good. We might use a combination of them. Um, we'll see what looks best. Um, but I want to look for some accessories. And I've written some down that I found earlier that we're going to try out. But we're not going to see the accessories yet. Obviously, we need some hair for Obunga. So we basically just need some short black hair here. So I'm going to go to all accessories. I'm going to go to body parts and hair. And I'm going to type in short black. And oh, this one. This could work. The black slick buzz cut. This could probably work for Obunga. Um, this might be a little bit too fancy for Obunga. But we're going to try it anyway. So I'm going to buy that. I'm going to go slap it on the character. And we are going to put it on. Now, again, we're going to look for a face here. But again, it's not necessary because we're actually going to end up using an accessory. But I wanted to show two versions of this with a face, like a normal face, and then one with an accessory. So a face that would probably work good is maybe the zombie face. I mean, we have other faces available, like the classic alien face. Yeah, I don't know about the zombie face. Like, let me go to my profile and show you guys what it looks like because I want to get a closer look up on what it actually is. Like, look at that. I, I think it's a... It's, it's, it's terrifying. The eyes definitely match up, but the mouth doesn't match up as well. But we could use the classic alien face 
as well. So if I refresh, you can see what the classic Alia face looks like. And this is a little bit more like Ob Obunga with the expression, just the eyes are a little bit off. Um, I don't really know what would be the best one to use here. Maybe the alien face? Cause we do get the classic alien and the alien face and oh, maybe the alien face is the one to go to. Now again, we're gonna end up using an accessory I think cause I found an accessory earlier that looks really good. But overall, I think we have a good thing going on. So guys, while we are applying this and we're about to go on the accessories, so don't go anywhere cause we're about to view some really cool accessories. I wanna tell you that I have a Discord now, a brand new Discord for my Zef Games fans. And basically you can chat to me on it. You can chat to other Zef Games fans and you guys can suggest me Roblox account ideas. I'm gonna be looking at there every day and asking you guys, you know, what do you guys wanna see? What kind of Roblox accounts do you guys wanna see? So you can suggest the Roblox account you wanna see in the Discord. Obviously you can suggest in the comment section as well, but I'm more likely to see it in the Discord. So make sure to join. Link is down in the description at the end of the video. Make sure to join at the end. Make sure to watch the entire video first, then join at the end. But anyways, getting back to it. So we have sort of a basic Obunga, but we're not gonna use that overall because I have some accessories that I want to show you. Okay, so the first accessory on our list, we're gonna go to accessories and go to head. Now we're gonna compare two of them that I found. So the first one I found was something called Memories. Now, I don't think this is my favorite one, but it does look very creepy. But the reason I kind of like it because it has those hollow, hollow eyes and it has the crazy face. So that is one option. Now, there's another option here that I think is the better option, but I'll let you guys decide it down in the comments or in the Discord. And I'm going to type in this, and I think this is a better option. Look at this the pleading face. Now, the skin color is not exactly, but the eyes look exactly like Obunga here. I mean, look at Obunga there. Look at the eyes here. They look pretty crazy. So I think we're gonna try the pleading face for now. You guys can try the memories face if you want, but uh, I think the pleading face will look quite interesting with what we're gonna do. So guys, now is the time. I gotta put everything together, put it on the character. We're gonna hop in game. We're gonna see how Obunga looks overall. So if you guys are ready for this, make sure to drop a like, subscribe down below. Make sure to use star code Zeph plays from my Robux and Premium. And remember, at the end of this video, make sure to join the Discord. The link is down in the description. Guys, I think this turned out better than I thought. Like something about it, I think with the narrow head that we bought I think it actually turned out better than I originally anticipated and I'm gonna show you guys here in a second how it looks like so guys I know you've probably been wondering okay what's that about Obunga that I don't know about well I'm gonna finally tell you guys basically if you didn't know Obunga is a meme. No, I'm just kidding all you guys know it's a meme but Obunga was actually created in 2018 all right, which maybe not a lot of you guys knew. It's become a recent meme again, but I remember seeing it back in 2018 and that's when it was originally created of a photoshopped image of Obama. But anyways, let's go ahead and reveal this character in three, two, one. There's the back of the character and wait till you see the front. Look at that. I think this turned out better than I thought it would have because look, look. With the face, it like overlaps into the trimmed sort of narrow head and you got the eyes and you even got the hair fitting perfectly. Like overall guys, I think we created a great, great Obunga. So guys, let me know down in the comments how I did. Let me know who I should make next. Make sure to join the Discord. Thank you so much for watching. As always, have a nice day and I'll see you guys later. Peace.